Hi there. Welcome to Southern Ontario's lovely humid heat wave. Just want to talk for a few minutes about your air conditioner, some things you can do to make sure that your house stays cool and your air, air conditioner keeps working. First of all, do plan on having um, a maintenance schedule set up with your maintenance people, but not during a heat wave because they're just too darn busy fixing and repairing and replacing air conditioners. Um, cover your air conditioner so that it doesn't get filled with debris and things over the winter time in the spring and summer. Um, it should be cleaned off. You want to make sure that the fins are cleaned. So you use a hose with a little bit of pressure on it. Make sure you shut off the, um, uh, the electrical to the air conditioner while you're doing this. Um, inside the house, make sure that your vents are balanced so that you're not pushing cold air down to the basement. You're, you're pushing the cold air up into the rooms that you're living in at this point in time, your bedrooms, your living room, that sort of thing. Um, make sure that your drapes and blinds are closed. Keep the sun out of the house because that's what's heating it up. As far as um, what temperature to use, inside the house they recommend um, into the 70s. I know 71, 72 is lovely, um, but sometimes when it's so hot outside, it's just not feasible to keep it at that temperature. You might want to look at 75, 76, even 78 degrees. Um, and uh, just so long as it's dry in the house, there's no humidity, it'll feel cooler. If you have ceiling fans, keep them on. Um, again, the air movement helps, um, helps you know, dry off any sweat on our skin, then helps us feel cooler or even one of the old rotary uh, fans as well it really helps as well. So those are a few tips to stay cool and don't forget to hydrate. That's it. Bye for now.